everybody, you've got an A-Team figure for you today. This one is John Hannibal Smith from the A-Team Soldiers of Fortune Living on the Edge. These came out in 1983, along with the TV series. They did do two lines of figures. This was the sort of five inch scale versions made by Galoob and they also made some three and three quarter inch figures that were very similar to G.I. Joe and they had very bright coloured costumes. These size figures though do have a little bit more screen accurate costumes. So I'm just taking a closer look at him there, you can see he's got this rather goofy looking face. We've got the brown jacket, the blue jeans and the trainers. And you can see he's got a couple of guns there. The bubbles on these are pretty yellow I must admit. But these are, what, the 29 years old now? So with each of these figures you get this little cardboard bit inside there. And it says with full set of action accessories we get an M16 rifle and shoulder strap. That will be that gun there. Auden's backpack and harness, a uh, supply belt with canteen and pistol, we can see his belt on him there, the canteen's moulded on, and the pistol will be in that bit somewhere. M60 automatic weapon and cartridge belt, so that's the M60 there, and it does have a little hole in it where you can slide the little bullet uh, cartridge thing through. Fully poseable action figure, we've got bendy knees, we've got swivelly legs, they do have a waist cut and also swivelly arms and his head turns. So for its day these were pretty articulated. So on the back of the card we can see Mr T as Beer Baracus, Bad Attitude, Genius Mechanic, John Hannibal Smith, Brainy Leader of the Team and Master of Disguise, Templeton Peck, The Face, he gets by on his looks, Howling Mad Murdoch, Slightly Wacky Ace Pilot, Slightly Wacky, <laughs> Amy A. Allen, Triple A, Talented Newspaper Reporter. Now they did actually release Amy Allen as a figure, she was one of the um, three ladies that were on the A-Team and she was the first one in the sort of first season, she did disappear after a while. Collect all the A-Team figures, sets and accessories, some assembly required on accessories, instructions included. Uh, 1983 Stephen J. Cannell Productions. So on the top of the card we can see the A-Team, four men and one woman who take on daring assignments anywhere in the world. The men originally met in Vietnam, where they were wrongly imprisoned by the US military. After their escape, they met in America. Now they are taking on dangerous missions that help them make a living and raise money for their future defence, if necessary. The combination of their amazing talents helped them out of constant trouble during their gruelling adventures. Now the A-Team was a fantastic show. I absolutely loved it as a kid, and I still love it today. I've got them all on DVD, and I've seen them all last year. I just sat and watched them all back to back, absolutely fantastic. So there you go, that's Hannibal from the A-Team. I do have some loose ones of these, but they're in pretty bad shape and they're missing all the accessories, so I didn't think I'd bother showing you that. You can pretty much get the idea from this one. So I hope you've enjoyed seeing him. This has been Luke, thanks for watching. I'll see you next time.